Okay, this is my experiment. The loaf on the right is made without yeast, and it took all day to rise. The dough on the left is made with yeast, and it is a bit puffier, and it only took about an hour or two to rise after the initial overnight rise. Looking at it closely, the only difference that I can see is that the sourdough on the right, which was made without yeast, hasn't risen quite as much, but the crumb works fairly well on both of them. All right, here's my bread. I'm getting ready to do a taste test, but I just want to show you, I know this is my uh, sourdough without yeast because it got a little bit browner. And that was probably my fault because I had other stuff in the oven. So anyway, so there's a difference. But this is the first slice after I cut the end off. And you see, I mean, there's not that much of a size difference. But there was a, a lot of difference in the uh, time as far as the second rise. Anyway, I'm going to taste this one first. I'm expecting this one to be a little more sour because it fermented longer. So I don't. I want to taste this one first and then I will drink a some water to make sure I get the taste out of my mouth. Okay, here it goes. And of course, I know what this bread tastes like. This is what I normally make, so, but I just wanted to do a, be able to do a side by side comparison. And it tastes like it normally does. You can taste a little bit of the sourdough taste. It's not overwhelming. I put sugar in my sourdough, so it's not extremely sour, so. Okay, now here is the next one. Let's see if it smells different. It really don't. And honestly, I don't see any taste difference either. So, anyway, that's the way it is. Um, I don't see really much of a difference between the two, except that it did take a lot longer, and there's no commercial yeast. So if you're trying to get away from commercial yeast, sourdough is the way to go, of course. Um, if you're doing like me and maybe working at a farmer's market and you need um, need your bread to rise a little bit faster, you can throw a little bit of yeast in there. really doesn't change the flavor at all that I can tell. This is the way I like to eat my bread in the mornings. Toasted with butter and two farm fresh eggs. I hope y'all are having a wonderful day. And if you don't mind, if you haven't subscribed yet, would you do that? And also, we'd appreciate it if you'd give us some thumbs up. Have a great day.